Greetings, and Merry Christmas, everyone. And today, since it's Christmas, I decided I'm going to tell you a story of a real Christmas miracle. But for this, I'm going to have to bring you back to World War I. At the time, it was known as the Great War because it was known as considered the war that would end all wars. Cause it was the biggest war ever. It seemed like almost every country was at war with each other. Well, mostly. It was brutal. People were, yeah, so, had many fatalities. Most of which weren't actually due to getting shot. But, even in the truest conditions that people have, have had to go through, where disease was the most likely thing to kill them, or and people were getting yeah, inhaling poison gas for the first time in warfare. There was one thing that happened. It was almost it was Christmas time. It had been raining for you know for so long that yeah the dugouts were in trenches were being flooded. Yeah, soldiers were sta standing up to their. Some people were having to stand up to their knees in mud. But, one day, it was almost around Christmas, the rain stopped. Because of how cold it was, all the most mud froze and created a solid floor for everyone to stand on. And, on, on one side of the, yeah, of the trenches, people started to sing. And on the other side, people were ordered to sing another, yeah, Christmas, another song, louder. But in the end, both sides ended up singing the same song. I think it was Good King Winces, or something like that. People came from other sides of the trenches, yet, and weren't, and they weren't fighting. They were just hanging out. They were celebrating Christmas. Because even though everyone was far away from home, fighting in a war that they didn't even know what they were fighting for, they still had the Christmas spirit. And this wasn't just a one-day thing. If I remember correctly, it lasted for almost about two weeks. It was amazing. People who were just shooting at each other days earlier, were sharing a drink and playing soccer. Yeah. Yeah, trading cigarettes. Yeah, for, and cigars. Of course, there were some people who took advantage of this kindness to, you know, to get an advantage in the war, like repairing, repairing trenches, all that. But, it was, it was still amazing. Yeah, how... Yeah, how a war was stalled just for the spirit of the soldiers fighting it. Of course, though, it had to end. And when it did, two, yeah, yeah, two commanders from both sides met in the middle of no man's land, and both fired a shot off into the air, signifying yeah, the end of the ceasefire. But no one wanted to shoot. In the end, they had or a 24-hour cav artillery strike was ordered. Machines of war go shooting it, yet yeah, putting an end to, yeah, to the cheers, spirits of man. But it still remains a true Christmas miracle. Merry Christmas, everyone.